Juan Soto and the New York Yankees agreed Thursday to a one-year, $31 million contract that broke the record set by Shohei Otani for a player eligible for salary arbitration. Soto earned a salary of $23 million last year, his only full season with San Diego. He can become a free agent at the end of next season, when he will be 26 years old. The Dominican hit .275 with 35 homers, 109 RBIs, and an OPS of .930 last year with the Padres, who acquired him from Washington on August 2, 2022, after he rejected a 15-year, $440 million offer that the Nationals did. The Yankees acquired Soto from the Padres last month. If you suffer from joint pain, I'll introduce you to Joint Restore. Joint Restore CBD is a product for joint health. This supplement is formulated with CBD oil, cannabidiol, which is extracted from the cannabis plant. One of the primary benefits of Joint Restore CBD is its potential to relieve joint pain. CBD acts on the body's endocannabinoid system receptors, reducing the sensation of pain and discomfort, making it a natural option for people suffering from arthritis, osteoarthritis, or other chronic joint pain conditions. Joint Restore has a mild strawberry flavor with subtle hints of Boswellia flowers. Additionally, Joint Restore collaborates with an FDA-approved and U.S. Hemp Authority certified lab. Get a 30-day supply of these gummies for just $1.33 per day by clicking the pinned link in the comments below to start your order. Jason Dominguez knew how to turn his 2023 around. What many may forget is that 2023 did not start well for Dominguez, who was in his first prolonged intervention in AA. In fact, the man from Dominican Republic reached the middle of the campaign hitting .204-.345-.346 at that level. In fact, the Martian came to think that the year was already lost. I didn't do well in the first half, Dominguez recalled this week. By the beginning of the second, I basically put it in my head, well, I've had 300 shifts. I'm not in a very good moment to take it up again. The thought I had was, Concho, I'm going to start working now for next year. Start preparing so that something like this doesn't happen. In other words, Dominguez had already given up by last year. But in the process of preparing for 2024, he saved his 2023 with great fanfare. After there, I followed my normal routine, with a different mentality, not so worried about it, he explained. And things worked out. Of course, Dominguez had an encouraging start with the Yankees. And long term, he figures to be the team's long term center fielder. However, much remains to be seen in 2024. What is known is that Dominguez, at some point this year, will return to that veteran clubhouse in New York to continue learning. Subscribe to the channel TO, receive the latest news from the Yankees. I'll be back soon with more updates from the Yankees.